Yeah, no, nah, Back to Saturn X is probably one of my favorite wads that I've played. I really, really have been enjoying this wad. God, I like that sound. Whoa! Holy shit! I think our boy over here is infighting. So don't take your eyes off him for too long. He will fuck you up. What the f it's now. We got ourselves a fucking. I'm running. I'm running. I know what what it is. We got a Plumexus. All right, these guys. What the fuck, bitch? Are you serious? Ah! Oh, no way! Not like this. Fuck! It's called. Cool. There it is. That's it. I'm sure of it. And he gave us a rune as well. Red armor. Check out this motherfucker. This could be one of my favorite weapons, or at least like favorite BFG tier weapons. This thing's fucking. This is an animal. This is a beast. Do not challenge hey there guys, Ultraviolence, welcome back to my channel. Uh, before we get into the video, I just wanted to give you a quick update on how the face cam is looking in the future. What you're going to see in this video is actually not how it currently is because I've been making more changes to it. Uh, it kind of sucks in this video and probably the one after as well and maybe the one after that. Uh, I forgot to move it and it was covering the kills items and secrets part of the video like the top left corner of the screen which sucks but um that's just how it's going to be unfortunately but i just wanted to show you just to give you some like peace of mind that it's not going to be like that forever i've already fixed it so right now my, my face is at the bottom right corner of the screen and this is how it will look when i am doing the intro of the video and i'm like you know we're on the load screen and i'm reading out the map name and whatever and then when we get into the actual game, I'll be like this down here. Um, so what I've got in the background is the screenshot because I couldn't be fucked recording a clip just for this. But um, as you can see, uh, the background is cut out. I don't have a green screen yet, but I found a way to uh, actually block out the background. So it's just me. Hopefully this makes me less distracting for some of you out there who, pref who prefer the videos without the face cam. I think it's a lot better. The maps that I played before went really well. A lot of funny moments and my genuine, my, my reactions to some things were, I, I personally think they were great. So stick with me, give it another shot. It's going to be a long ride because it takes a while to turn these things around when these videos go for so long and they take a long time to edit. I'm thinking we're actually going to upload daily for a few days again because I want to just get to the videos where the face cam is where it is now at, it, at its best because I'm, I don't want to be reading too many more comments saying that you don't like the face cam because I want it to be good. <laughs> All right, anyways, let's get on with the video. Well, today we are back with Back to Saturn X with Pandemonia and uh, we're on map fucking, I don't even know what to be honest. Um, map 17, navigating flood regions. I've got some bad news. Um, yesterday I actually played like two or three maps and then uh, realized I wasn't recording at the end, right at the end, right after I had been really happy with the three maps or whatever that I played because they were so good. I got some new weapons as well and uh, uh, so annoyed, but um, we're gonna have to replay the maps tonight. All right, let's get into the game. We've got ourselves a Cyber Hell Viscount. We'll try to assassinate you. Chain Gunner fires Maximus projectiles and Nail Gunner Arachnatron and its species consumes corpses to gain extra health. I'm not a big fan of this one. It's just like, I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of it. It's too niche, but um, these two are uh, probably interesting. I don't know what a Maximus is, but it sounds pretty mean. I asked in a discord what this, uh, this one here means. Like, what does it mean by this dude is going to try and assassinate you? So apparently at some point during the map, this guy will spawn near me. Not where I can see, but somewhere nearby. And he will have increased health, increased damage, and like increased aggressiveness. And if this uh, card is a permanent card, so it will like, keep happening in every map, every time I kill this dude, he gets stronger every time he spawns in future maps. So that's actually pretty freaking cool. There is actually, I'm pretty sure, there is a compendium thing. I'm not sure how to find the compendium thing that shows all the cards and their details. There it is, it's right there. So I guess if I find the cards in here that I'm using, I can like properly read about them. I don't know, but you can actually like see there's like a screen that shows uh, with the text that it explains a little bit more in detail, which is pretty cool. So if you're ever curious of what your cards do, check that out. That's pretty sweet. Anyways, we're going to play now. This map was a, a bit of a struggle yesterday, but um, it's actually a very, very good map. Like I was really happy with this. 
there's a really cool part later where you come back to this area and it's all broken and it's like been destroyed and I I'm keen for you guys to see that. It sucks that you're not going to get to see my genuine first experience on the map, but can't be helped, unfortunately. Maybe one day I'll stop being a dickhead, but that day was not yesterday. I love that I can just shoot this up in there and it'll come down and kill anything that's there. Well, it'll kill some stuff. Miss everyone else. Um, so we got a few motherfuckers around the place. Let's get this in here. Hopefully give everything. One more shot for good luck. Get fucked. I'm gonna wake as much stuff up as possible. I miss. Is there more in there? My god, there's so much. And you've got to be really careful of that dark rev up there. My god. I really wish I had a grenade launcher right now. I think best bet for this rev is to literally just go to town with this. I think we got him. I saw the green explosion. There's another one up there, but it's it's okay. It's okay. Get wrecked. Go away, rev shit. Oh my god. There's armor there. Oh my god, take that shit. Um, alright, let's try and... Uh... Nah, fuck it, we'll go this way. Oh, there's a guy right here. Dude, that is sneaky. Another good thing about me playing this map yesterday, or these maps yesterday, is that... My memory is bad, and I've probably forgotten everything about them. Let's deal with these dipshits. Dead. Wait. Get nail gun. Oh, this is the fusion arachnophyte. This thing... Oh, I should have left it alive. That's the one that actually shoots the, the shit that the shotgunner shoots. That, that pink shit. But it, like, rapid fires it. So, like, that's kind of terrifying, to be honest. There's definitely more in here. Okay, so that must be the fucking hell viscount or whatever. But where? No, 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 no. Just rocket that guy when you see him, because he's, he's fucking deceptively strong. Where would that viscount be? I swear to God, it sounded like he was real close. If it even him. He wouldn't have spawned in a wall, would he? No freaking way. Oh my god, I thought he would have died. Yeah, nah. Back to Saturn X is probably one of my favourite wads that I've played. I really, really have been enjoying this wad. It's just got the right mix of, like, complex like complicated and, and like detailed areas and also simple stuff as well just easy on the eyes some not like heaps maze like but there is a bit of exploration which is cool i can't remember what happens here okay i remember now i'm just gonna wrong weapon but that's okay oh my god you see out the window jesus christ no! Get the fuck away! Don't curve. God, I like that sound. Whoa! Holy shit! No way, you're dead. Get shit on. Oh, get fucked! Yeah, so, um... In, in this map yesterday, there is actually like a... I don't want to spoil it though, to be honest. Nah, don't worry about it. I'm just going to say we got a weapon. And what I'm saying is if I don't get that weapon this time, I'm just going to spawn it in for myself. Because... Because I want it, and I had it, and it's not fair that I was stupid. I will not pay for my mistakes. Ever. 
Let's get rid of these barrels. Hmm. All right, blue key. <laughs> Yesterday when I when I played this, I went right past this door and pretty much did a whole loop around the map again, trying to figure out what I was supposed to do. And then came back here like, you know, classic UV, just missing the door that's right in front of him. Wouldn't be my channel without doing something like that, though. I'm going to die. Just use this. <laughs> oh my god, that was fucking... There's another one. Don't die. We did not just survive all that to die right there. Oh my god. Dude, that was fucked. That was so close. <laughs> Isn't there a man out here? I swear I saw one. Here he is. Oh, there's two. You got a friend. Oh, get wrecked. I saw a comment yesterday from someone saying that they think that this weapon should be buffed, like the projectiles should go further. I would be interested to see, like, if you could do some cool shit by bouncing it off walls and stuff, but I, I do think it's fine. Like, you can easily just swap it over to regular shot if you want range. And there are also other weapons that have long range as well. You don't need this to be like that. I think the short range is cool. It's not exactly under... What the fuck? It's not like underpowered because of it or anything, but it does make it more fun when you actually use it in scenarios that like bring out its strengths. It just, it's just a bit of extra thought that you have to put into using the weapon and I think that's, it actually makes it more fun to use. I forget what happens, but we should build up some overcharge if we can. Yeah, I don't know why this is here. Is there a secret or something? I'm gonna hit that. Don't know what it does, but I'm hitting it. I'm hitting it. Let's make sure I'm recording because fuck. I am. It's all good. It's all good in the hood. Don't worry. All right. What did we accomplish by coming up here? I'm assuming this is yellow key. Ah, the fuck is it? All right. What have I missed? What did I miss? Tell me, please. Oh, I know what spawned in before. It's that gang of fuckwits. Whoa, 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 I think our boy over here is infighting. So don't take your eyes off him for too long. He will fuck you up. What the fuck? Dude, he got fucked! He got actually- he actually got fucked up! Is, the, is this guy still called War? Pandas- oh, okay, Sentinel. His name is a Sentinel. Holy fuck, dude. He fucking annihilated that shotgunner. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. I thought that was a real rocket, like a, a regular rocket. Not one of those lightweight ones. Oh my god, I... Holy shit. <laughs> my heart skipped a beat there. <laughs> Rev, can you kindly stand still for it? Just shoot at me. Take a shot. Take a shot. What are you doing? God damn. Stop dancing like a bitch. Oh yeah, this part was rough. But uh, with my quick wit and uh, epic skills, I made it. I made it through this in one go, but it is very likely that I won't. So when you step in here, this whole area like sinks. And I only survived last time because I actually did grab the Megasphere like straight away. But there was a lot of stuff. Um, oh, that was a waste. Fuck. What should I use? I'll probably try and charge this up. Maybe BFG first. Maybe we'll try and save it. Oh no, there's a vial. That's right. 
I'm grabbing it. I don't care. Am I taking floor damage? I am. <gasps> oh my god. I don't even know he was charging up his attack. Oh my god, there's fire. Alright. I'm turning up the music. This sounds quiet. Is it? I think it's just this map. Or is my headphones, my actual volume low? Who knows, man? I'm gonna keep going. What? Oh, it's the assassin! He's here! What do you got, man? Health is 900. It's James Bond. And he's dead. We just killed James Bond. Get wrecked. We should move while the rad suit is active. Because last time I didn't do that and I regretted it. Oh, fuck. I forgot to do something at the start of the map. That's right. I can edit it in. Big barrels. I like this one. It has like a few areas here and there with barrels actually in convenient spots. And I, mm, I, and I like that a lot. My God. Also, big shout out to Pandemonia for having no annoying screen color effects. I had the red suit just then, but my screen wasn't green. I appreciate that. I like that a lot. Okay, I wanted to do this at the start, but I'm gonna, I'll just have to edit it in. These are my active cards right now. I'm, tr I'm trying to like get into the habit of doing this at the start. I did it yesterday, but forgot today. And also the uh, game level is 56. So uh, if you want to check out what cards I've got, now's your chance, pause the video. And that's that. I forget what happens. All right, fill up my armor item. Yeah, so if you, uh, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but if, uh, if you pick up little armor shards and you have this armor item, the reconstruction kit, the uh, armor shards don't actually go to your armor. They go into this kit. That way you can actually like stock up and save for when you've got armor you want to keep. Really good considering that this wad has fucking like cybernetic armor and shit. Really good. No, thank you. Who is this? Rocket zombie? No. The worst guy. I kind of want that shotgunner to be added into actual Pandemonia. I feel like this, the, the threat of him like how strong he is and how quickly he can do damage is actually like adding to the experience a lot more than I expected it to. I don't feel like it's too bullshit. It's keeping me like scared and like aware, making me use my brain and that's what I like. Get, yeah. oh fucking. Dude, you're shooting real good today. Good aiming, congratulations. All right, let's rocket these bitches. Let's miss two. It's fine. God, you really gonna take another one? Uh, no thanks. Oh God. These guys look a lot scarier than they are. Is that all you got? Is that it? Use your rockets. Do you actually have any? Maybe he like ran out of rockets. He left them at home or something. <laughs> why is my armor blue and green? This happened yesterday and I didn't know why. Oh, is it because it's over a hundred? Because I use this item to make it over a hundred percent. So now it's like partly blue. That's actually a cool detail. If that's the case, or it's bugged, I don't fucking know. Yoink. All right, we're going pretty strong here. I'm trying to remember, I know there's a point here where like lots of shit comes out. And I'm trying to remember when the fuck that is. It's now. We got ourselves a fucking, I'm running. I'm running. I know what what it is. We've got a Plamexus. I would love if they could infight, but... This guy is actually, like, a tough fucking cyber. I fought him before when Pandemonium was first being, like, you know, first in its, like... In its first iteration. And 
I feel like he's way scarier now, but Dust told me that he hasn't really seen any any changes. He's just a sick motherfucker. Alright, these guys... What the fucking bitch? Are you serious? Oh! No way, not like this! Are you kidding me? Oh my god, that fucking shotgunner actually, like, ruined everything. I can't believe that. This is the best I've got. This is the closest I've got to a railgun right now. Dude, fuck this guy. Oh my god. Not a fan. Is it dead? I think it's dead. How do I get that invo? I forgot. I know I got it last time. Oh, I remember, I think. Do I remember? Yes. Oh, I fucked up. I fucked up. I just realized how to get it. I have to go in there. I activated, the, I spawned them in too early. I did this next part too early. God damn it. God. He's got some... He's got some mean attacks, this dude. God, you see that? He switched to attacking, like, so quickly while he was taking BFG shots. I can really feel, like, an increased aggression level. I swear to God. Oh, my God. What are you doing? What was that? I didn't see that yesterday. Dude, check out these attacks. They're so cool. Oh, come on, man. You want to battle? I'll fight you. From a distance like a bitch. All right, if he didn't drop his gun, I'm spawning it in. I don't care. Wrong weapon, but it's okay. This will work, kind of. Where is... You! <laughs> You're the one that I'm looking for. Oh my god. Scary. Are you gonna come around or... No. Dude, this guy has like some seriously cool attacks. Very nice. Let's get this charged. Oh, beautiful. Now, pump our armor up a little bit. I want to go for the secret, but I'm going to take damage. Is there a suit somewhere? I can't remember if there's anything in there, so I'll bring the uh, plasma. And here is the invo. God damn it. So yesterday, when I was here, I did this, like, two-minute long talk about why I should or shouldn't grab this. And then, like, at, right at the end, I accidentally hit forward and I just grabbed it. And then I fell down as well, and I was stuck with the Invol running around down there trying to get back up in time. And by the time I got back, it ran out. It was hilarious. But, uh, nah. I didn't record it, because uh, I'm a very smart man. I've got it now, though. I don't think much spawns down here, though. I shouldn't have grabbed it, but whatever. Give me your Heliacal Arc... <laughs> Whatever the fuck it's called. There it is. That's it. I'm sure of it. And he gave us a rune as well. Red armor. Check out this motherfucker. D Where? Go away. Oh my God. Saving right here. Right now. Right here. Right now. Yeah, no. Nah, I'll, I'll tell you what, because I just saved as well. We'll give it a fucking test shot. Is there dudes out here? Who wants to fucking go? Come on. Come on, everyone come in. Come, get into the middle. Get into the middle. Get into the middle. Get into the middle. Come on. No, not one at a time. I want you to all fucking fight me. Dude, look at that! 
It's so strong. Anyway, I'm not wasting it like that, but I just wanted to sh I just wanted to show you. Look at this. This is uh, this could be one of my favorite weapons, or at least like favorite BFG tier weapons. This thing's fucking. Uh, this is an animal. This is a beast. It is a durability weapon as well. You can see it's got the the health bar there. I feel like should I point? I feel like because I have a camera, I have to like point. There's the health bar there. Um, kind of like. Oh wait, we got the this. Okay, yesterday this uh, completionist reward gave me another street sweeper, which was awesome. However, I only used it then because I was desperate. I'm gonna not use it now. Actually, fuck it. Nah, what if it's shit? We did save though, so it's fine. Give us something sick. Nah, redo. <laughs> I'm not gonna use it now. <laughs> oh, the power of saves. It's beautiful. Oh, there's so much stuff. Oh, how did I get in here? What the fuck? Did I teleport? What just happened? I'm so confused. I, I reckon I got booped in the ass and they pushed me over there. Don't push me. But I could go through so many rockets fighting these dudes. Nah, we're actually gonna do it. That is the sickest fucking weapon ever. I'm so glad we got it again as well. Did they just explode? Did they explode on death just then? I'm confused. I noticed that yesterday as well that I killed some enemies that were nearby and they exploded like that after using that weapon. He did as well. Are they like primed or something? Are you primed? What is going on? I'm very intrigued. Yeah, what happens here? How's our ammo for this? Alright, so this thing is much more durable than the Street Sweeper, which is very good. I'm happy that I can actually have fun with the weapon before it breaks. Alright, switch time. And now we head back. So, uh, if this looks familiar to you, there is a good reason for that. This is, like, so cool, man. This texture work here is just brilliant. This is the same area we were in at the start of the map, but it's all like destroyed and broken and stuff. I'll take that. Fucking oath, man. Give me all the health. Like, this is so sick. Look at that texture work there. Is that a custom texture just for that? That's like very not Doom like, but it's fucking awesome. Go away, bitch. I'll, f I'll come get you. I'll fuck you up. I stack out these dudes quick and quick and smart and get hit by them. Oh good, don't worry, I have lots of health, lots of armor that I'm very eager to get rid of, apparently. Now, I remember using this here yesterday as well because there were a ton of monsters, but we've already used it once and I would rather not. Okay, regrets have been had. God, I love pulling a 180 like that and just fucking dudes up. Please attack me so I can shoot you. Thanks, man. Much appreciated. Hey, man. Hey, Vile. You're a good guy, all right? You're a good guy. Oh, hell no. Was there a Vile? There is a vial, what the fuck? Good aim. Well, that could have been bad. Luckily this weapon is amazing and doesn't kill me like a regular rocket launcher does. Oh, get fucked, how are you alive? Again, I'm gonna need you to stand still and take a shot at me. Oh my God, bro, was... Was that the same one? It must have been. 
And, uh... There's two monsters left. So apparently the, uh... The, the respawning shotgunners don't uh, count towards the monster count at all, so... They're not tied to the completionist rewards, so that's good. Um... But I can't actually get back, so... We are done. Such a good map, dude. We got 100% secret, 100% items. Wait, does that, do I get a completionist reward for that as well? Please. Do I? Oh, we're gonna get different things this time as well. Blood rain? Empowering monsters? Ooh, that sounds cool. Uh, Dark Revenant and its species reflects projectiles. Gross. That would mean Rebs would have shields and they'd be able to deflect. <laughs> no, sir. Devil Imp... Devil fires Plamexus projectiles? I don't know what to... I have to pick that. But the blood rain. The blood rain. I don't know what to pick. We... I, I have to do this. <laughs> I have to, man. <laughs>